Hey guys, welcome back to One Pretty Little Box. I am so glad that you are here. It is so good to get regular videos back going again. Um, who knew that our internet was so crappy before? You guys, it would take me 24 hours to upload a video um, the way our internet was. Now I'm getting it done in, in the evenings and it's so nice. So I'm very excited for what's to come for this channel again. Let's hop to it. I wanted to give you some words of wisdom for this Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. We've made it to hump day. It's the middle of the week and it's about this time where we kind of get into a good groove. But usually on Thursdays, I personally always seem to hit a wall. Um, I have for years and I realized that it is a mindset that is in me. But that is not today's topic. Today's topic for you guys is this. There are three things keeping you from what you really want to do in this life. Three things. And they're all up to you. And none of them are money. Uh, everyone thinks that you have to have money to follow your dreams, to chase your goals, to achieve what you want to achieve. And while money might be a venue, and money might be an outlet, and money might be part of it, it's not as big as you think it is. The other three, however, really, really are. And the first one is fear. The second one is um, not being disciplined. And the third is excuses. If you will remove the excuses, one, you're gonna find the discipline. And when you find the discipline, you're going to realize that fear was just something in your mind. It's not wasn't even real to begin with. So, so, come on. And I'm kind of preaching to the choir here. Um, there's a lot that I'm wanting in my life. Some things that I'm wanting to do that I hadn't even touched on because I was fearful, fear of rejection. But I'm learning no one's opinion matters more than my own. Um, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what you think of me. I value when the things that I share with you bring you value and you let me know that. I love hearing that my time was invested well. Um, even if just one of you say, hey, thanks for this video, it was great. I understand that the 10 minutes I took out of my schedule to film it, and then the time it takes to edit and get it all up and all that good stuff was worth it. And honestly, sometimes I can go back and watch my videos and I inspire myself. I'm trying not to be cocky, I'm just being real, I'm just being honest. Um, I love to share, I love to share wisdom, I love to share encouragement, I love to inspire other people. That is something that I could do 24-7 and never be tired of doing. Never be overwhelmed. It's all the extra stuff that I'm doing that maybe I don't want to do, but I have to do because I can't do this full time. So, you know. All right, guys, my words of wisdom for you is to drop those three things. Get rid of the excuses. Start getting disciplined. Um, no matter what it is that you wanna do, if you're watching this video, you have access to the internet, which is an amazing thing. Um, it also tells me that you're not lacking for a whole lot if you have access to the internet. It means you either have a phone or you have a computer or you're at work and you have access there, utilize it. Utilize what you have when you have it. Be grateful for it and then use it for your advantage. Use it for your advantage. Everyone wants to say money is a big deal. Money is not a big deal. You do not need money to create. Today, I decided to film this video on my phone. Why? Because I can. Um, and of course with better internet, I can upload it to the computer to edit a whole lot faster than I was able to before. Um, at that time, the best way to do it was with my DSL and then load it and all that good stuff, but it was still a little difficult. But it didn't stop me from trying to encourage and inspire you because One Pretty Little Box also has a Facebook page, also has Instagram. So I'm constantly posting and sharing on those social media sites, <clears throat> even if I'm not sharing a video here. 
and it didn't cost me anything. Those are free. YouTube is free. If you're wanting to write, paper is usually right at our access. If anything, your computer or your phone has Office Word on it, and go to town. Self-publishers. If you're worried about being rejected from a publisher, self-publish your own book. I did it three times. About to do it again. Um, if you'd like, you guys want information on how to self-publish, let me know in the comments, and maybe that could be an upcoming video later down the road. Until then, I want you guys to let go of the excuses, because more than anything, that's what's holding you back the most. I was listening to Gary Vee this morning, and I'm going to take out a couple words because it would offend probably some of you, and it's not very YouTube friendly. <laughs> How he gets away with it, I have no idea. But um, shut up and do it. Shut up and do it. Stop talking about it and go do it. How many times do we sit around talking about what we want to do in our lives, the goals we want to achieve, the things and the dreams that we want to see come to fruition, but all we're doing is talking. You could be telling me a story. You could be telling me a joke. You could be telling me a whatever, but it's just talk. You gotta put forth the action. Talk is cheap. Everybody can talk. Everybody can share their dreams. Everybody can share their goals. Everybody might, who might have the same dream and goal as you, they could tell the world. But it's not gonna matter if you don't put forth the effort and you don't do it. So stop talking about it and do it. Let go of the excuses. Get a little discipline in your life. Carve out whatever time you need in a day. It can be done. It can be done. I'm rediscovering how many little pockets of time that I have. I had this time before I walk out the door for work for the day to film this video. I'll have a little pocket of time this at this evening to edit and to get it uploaded and rendered for tomorrow. And then I will have little pockets of time early morning to share the video on different social media outlets so other people can see it. Stop talking, start doing, let go of the excuses, throw fear to the side because it really is just another excuse. Get some discipline and get going. What is it that you're wanting in your life? Maybe you're doing it already, and if you are, here, high five to you because awesome. Maybe you're in a place of complacency and you're scared to say, hey, this is what I want. Maybe I need to do something about it. Get time to ponder. Everybody likes home day for that reason. It's a good, a good middle day of the week to get refocused, re-inspired, and to go kick some booty. And with that, my friends, I'm going to tell you, see you tomorrow. Bye.